so it's good weather outside. I'm off work this morning, working later on tonight, so I thought I'd have a crack at finding out any more Bruce Lee. So luckily, when Dave was here, working on the uh, Kermit FC bonnet, um, I took advantage of that and used him to help me find some Bruce Lee. So I found one down here. That Jubilee clip is slanted off, so it must have slipped off somehow. And that was leaking like quite substantially, so... So... Right, so spray some soapy water on a few junctions. She's slowly dropping. Nothing really coming from any of those, which is good. I have been working on a smoke tester because my cigarette technique was just wrecking my lungs. <coughs> uh, so let me show you what I've got here. I've got this metal tin with a soldering iron th thrown through it, and then that just comes off. Soldering irons in there. Yeah, excuse the sort of crappy cuts. And so I just took some rags in there soaked in baby oil apparently and then that will create some good smoke so, so we'll try that out and we'll also just try out the standard um, compression tester. Got some uh, baby oil and then we'll soak these rags in it, pop it into here, and basically just touching the solder iron and then pump air through that black pipe and then there should come out of there. If I blow some air into there. Um, oh, this is a bit hard to use. A little bit of air into there. I can see the smoke coming out of there. So look. Take it to the head, bitch. It draws like a pencil. So it actually worked quite well. Um, so we'll rack that wee yoke onto the car and see where the smoke comes out of. I'm pretty sure yes, actually, first. Just to prove that this. Smoke is working. Plenty of smoke. No smoke, no poke, guys. The obvious smoke coming from anywhere. Um, and on the front either. That's a bit of a nightmare. Um, right, so I was just off the phone to Johnny Woods there, and he made a few suggestions to my Bruce League tester. So, what I've done is I've just got basically an air fitting, so there's no valve in that. Set the regulator and the compressor to be running around um, 15 PSA. So I connect it up to this, so we have constant air pressure, and it builds up much faster because there's no valves here. So this new setup, there's no valve in here, so as you can hear the air just free flowing in. Go over our soapy water, and we'll see what we can find, so... Looks alright there. Let's take a little bit. Test that. See? And there's the big leak itself. Test everybody else from here. Let's see. Let's see if I notice there. Oh. Blows! Like that. So, after all that taking around, trying to use smoke, trying to use a Bruce Lee Tesla, which I bought online, all you really need is one of those fittings and a compressor. So, that one seems to be the, the worst. Exhaust needs to come off this anyway because exhaust is leaking. It sounds like a bag of dicks. So whenever I get the V8 finished, well, should I say once I get uh, Dave to finish my car for me, um, then I'll have space in the garage. And then once the garage is empty, bring this car in, rack off the exhaust, rack off the turbo, fix that all in one go, and I think that should be us. Um, I guess that's us now. And that's us now for a long time for this car because it's going to be a while before I can get uh, any work done in this car. So don't forget to click the like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel, 
uh, like us on Facebook, Instagram. We also have some cool stickers uh, for sale. If anyone wants any, just um, give any of us a message on Facebook or Instagram and we'll hook you up. Uh, cheers. See you later. Thank you.